Today we are gathered here at the Barrett Center for Technology Innovation for the presidential installation of Dr. Anne-Marie Vaughan. I'm truly honored to be joining the Humber community as its fifth president and the first woman in that role. I was truly inspired. I think what she said is so important. Um, it shows young girls that they can be anything they want to be. And I think it's just an history making moment and I'm so happy I'm here to see it. I'm, I got goosebumps. <laughs> I think uh, she's inspirational, she's incredible, and she's an excellent mom. Uh, it's not surprising that she would hit her stride and end up uh, at Humber at this amazing institute as president. So it's a, it's a very exciting day for myself and for my family and all our friends who have gathered here today. So. I'm really excited for my mom. It's, it's definitely a big step in her career and she's really happy to be here. I would describe my mom as strong, brilliant, big ABBA fan, a big thinker, very kind, considerate. She cared about the students and she's, she wanted to hear their voices. I was so inspired by the women who spoke today. Dr. Augustine and um, Anne-Marie Vaughn spoke and I was like, wow. And I was just so happy to see how much life is changing, the world's changing around us and how much more women are showing leadership in the world. We also had the opportunity to give Dr. Jean Augustine an honorary degree and we announced that we have a convocation medal named for her. We are making moves in the right direction. That there was a time when there were no women uh, in leadership positions. And now a college with such a large student body, with international reach, and that you would have a woman who would head this institution. It is fabulous, it's important, and uh, it's a signal to young women that the sky is the limit. What I know for sure is that Canada's preeminent college, we have a special place in the province and in the country. Our role in delivering polytechnic education is more important than ever. We have a lot we can do and accomplish together. I end my comments with the statement in honor of glass ceiling officially shattered.